What's that? It's Plains Plan Vlog. And you might be asking, what is this? Well, you see, this is my, um, this is a really old pineapple plant that has not, um, um, fruited yet. But we're going to force fruit it by using apples, apple slices, and you wrap them up, uh, using a bag or something to case the ethylene gas that gets released by them. And then when that happens, um, you leave it on for about a week or so. And then once the apples are all dried up, you take it off. And then about a month later, if it works, you'll have a bloom. Uh, works with any size of pineapple. Um, also, the bigger the plant, the more better the fruit. The bigger the fruit will be. And also, um, it doesn't always work. It's like a 50 50 chance because apples um, can be. Um, not as strong as a ethylene gas producer as using calcium carbide, which is a hundred percent success rate. But I'll give you updates on it. It's the um, one that I had for a while. This one was um, an indoor one a long time ago, for like five years. It was indoors, and then it was outside, and it got nice and big like this. So it's time for it to fruit, and then it's got like a whole. Almost a whole foot of stem. Most of it's underground now because it, I buried it, but it's gotten really big, so it's ready. So, yeah, I'm pretty, pretty excited. Um, I've heard that it only takes a little apple slice to make it work, and then I've also heard sometimes it takes a lot of apple slices to make it work, and sometimes it doesn't. I heard it doesn't work, and sometimes I hear it does work. So, it's an experiment. If it doesn't work, then I'll just use some calcium carbide from just get from the store and just drop some in the middle of it and put some water and then it's an automatic solution to that. But first we're gonna try the free solution using some apples and the more organic solution. Alright guys, that's about it. I'll give you updates uh probably in a month or so.